becoming conscious and teaching our children to be more conscious about the future of the environment and you know when we're seeing what's happening up in the Great Barrier Reef it, it's it's really concerning and I think it's it's our, our role now to, to teach the younger generation and make sure that they're aware and they don't make the same mistakes that we do. I guess it's a symbol of like, the power of nature and it's just great to be able to surf the waves. It's especially big today, so it's very good to get down here. Um, well, it's not as bad as it is in other places here, but yeah, the plastic count in the ocean is getting worse and up north, there'll be um, lots of fish will become, become extinct in the next few years, which is not good. Um, and obviously that will affect the ocean, the water's rising in temperature, so yeah, we gotta reduce greenhouse gases. I think it just to, to be able to come down here is to, to bring yourself back down to a peaceful feeling. When you look at the ocean and how big it is and how small we are, um, I, I think it just gives you that lovely feeling of um, being okay, um, peace of mind. I'm a diver and I've noticed um, in my 20 years or so since I've been diving that there's a, you know, fish stocks are less, the quality of the coral is not as good and yeah, I'm very concerned. I'm very concerned for the, for the future generation. Everything from plastic bags, it concerns me from, you know, all the rubbish. I think we need to be harder and more aggressive with it.